Welcome back to 4K Films Canada. I am Corey, and in today's video, we are looking at week 15 of Monday Daydreaming. We're actually going to go through, through uh, two titles today. The first one is XXX, you know, the action film from early 2000s with Vin Diesel. And we're going to look at the sequel to that with XXX State of the Union. So the first film of the series, I do think it actually has aged all things considered, pretty well. Uh, it's never been the best action film, but for what it is, it does have lots of action, and it's a lot of fun, kind of shut off your brain and relax type of film. And I do you think it would look fantastic with Dolby Vision and Dolby Atmos as well. In the opening scene with the metal music would be, the concert would look, I think, pretty well, and sound very good as well. And then it has lots of action and explosives, and it's just a lot of fun action movie. And I think it would really, really benefit from being upgraded to 4K. Now, however, I don't know how where this sits in Sony's priority list for upgrading to 4K. Um, they do have some pretty good ones coming out, and some they do do some. They do some titles that you wouldn't think would actually get a 4K, some under unexpected ones. So hopefully XXX is on that list eventually, because I do think it would look fantastic. And I also think Kino Lorber would do a good job with this as well. It'd kind of be like Hard Target. Hard Target's better, obviously, but it'd be in the same kind of vein as that. Of course, the next film, like I said, it's the sequel. So this one has not aged as well as the first one. It has some cheesy CGI moments. The story is not fully intact. It's not quite, it's just, it's not as well made as the first one. The first one has its faults, of course, but overall I think it is decently well made. This one doesn't have that, unfortunately going for it quite as much. It does have Ice Cube in it. I think Ice Cube does a pretty good job in this role. I do think Samuel Jackson is good in it. William Defoe is always good in all his roles. So of course William Defoe is probably his best he's probably the best performance of the film. And it has my favorite rapper exhibit in it as well. I would love to see more of him in the film, but that's not really the here or there. But yeah, again, lots of action. And this one has lots of darker dark scenes at nighttime. So I think HDR can take advantage of that. And again, Dolby Atmos, of course, from the action, would look fantastic as well. The same as the first one. I think it would look just as good as the first one, minus this, the cheaper CGI moments. So I would love to see this one come to 4K as well. Again, I don't know where this sits on Sony's priority list, but I'd love it to come. And again, Ken Lorber, they did this as well. I don't think this would be on their list of films to get from Sony, but if they did it, I would absolutely love to see it. And the third one already has 4K, so I don't have that yet. But if these two came to 4K, I'd absolutely pick that up. I do think the third one's from Paramount, however. I could be wrong on that. I've only seen it once. I don't know. Two, I don't even remember what happens in the third one, but yeah, I would love to see... The first two come to 4K. I think they do deserve it. I do think they're good enough movies for 4K. And I just really, really want them to get that upgrade. So yeah, let me know in the comments what you think of these films. Do you want them to come to 4K? What other films do you want to come to 4K? And I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Have a great night.